Now, the Port Harcourt Refining Company, PHRC, in the River State, has resumed operations aligned with the federal government's commitment to produce refined goods at a plant by December this year. Initially shut down in 2019, the combined processing capacity of the Nigeria's, or Nigeria's four refineries in Port Hackett, Wari, and Kaduna stood at 445,000 barrels per day. However, the refineries were rendered inoperative due to maintenance concerns. In August, the Minister of State for Petroleum Resources, Senator Heineken Lokobiri, during an inspection tour of the PHRC Limited plant, confirmed the refinery's plans to resume operations this month. The federal government allocated $1.5 billion for the rehabilitation of one of its biggest or largest oil refineries more than two years ago. The Italian company Mare Tecnimont was selected to oversee the repair work at the Port Hackett location, which has a production capacity of about 210,000 barrels per day. I recall that um, we ought to have held this TECO meeting sometime in the month of November. But for some reason, maybe by Providence, I was outside the country, GCO2 was outside the country, EVP was outside the country, most of us were outside the country, and so we couldn't hold this TECO. We rescheduled, and then something happened again, we were not in the country, and then eventually we resolved that it's better for us to hold to this step that will coincide, you know, with the commencement of um, operations, you know, of the protocol refinery. So, distinguished ladies and gentlemen, I'm not going to bore you anymore because, you know, people who have spoken before me have spoken all that I would have said, but just to announce to Nigerians, that the fulfillment of our pledge, you know, to bring on stream phase one of the Potaco refinery by the end of 2023, and the subsequent streaming of the phase two in 2024, we heartily announce the mechanical completion of flare up, flare start up on the 20th of December 2023. This heralds the commencement of production of petroleum products after the Christmas break. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.